The Monarch Butterfly Life Cycle. Milkweed is the plant that monarch butterflies lay their eggs on. Monarch butterfly adults also drink the nectar from the flowers that the milkweed plant has. When we break a leaf from the stem, you notice this milky substance that comes out from it, that's where the plant gets its name milkweed. The caterpillar stage. The caterpillars grow a lot during this stage which lasts about 10 to 14 days. Those beautiful stripes they have aren't just for show, they are there to let predators know that it's not a good idea to eat them. The milky substance that comes out of the milkweed plant is actually poisonous. Since the caterpillars only eat milkweed, it makes them poisonous to any predator that might want to eat them. Just like us, caterpillars need food and water to live and grow. They do a lot of growing in a very short period of time. So, that means they need to do a lot of eating. When a caterpillar becomes too big for its skin, it sheds or gets molten once. Since caterpillars do a lot of eating, they also produce a lot of waste. chrysalis stage. This stage lasts 10 to 14 days. When the caterpillar is ready, it will secure itself a spot by spinning a silky thread from which it will hang upside down and take the shape of a letter J. When you see that the antennas and become thinned out, you know that the process of becoming a chrysalis is about to begin. If you look closely you'll see that something is beginning to occur. Under its skin the caterpillar will begin to straighten out its J shape just before the transformation begins. This process takes about 5 minutes, so I'm going to speed up the film to 4 times faster. You can see this yellowish-green chrysalis pushing its way out of the caterpillar's bald skin. The caterpillar will continue to wriggle and push the old skin up until it can squirm around and let it drop to the ground. Soon, you will see a change in the chrysalis skin which becomes more and more translucent, and the monarch butterfly beneath will become more and more apparent, and finally it's ready to emerge. The following video is also in fast motion, the entire process takes about an hour. Once the butterfly is emerged from the chrysalis, it needs to pump blood and fluids out of its abdomen and into its wings. Here, we can watch how this process occurs. Now, the monarch butterfly will slowly open and shut its wings to dry them. It is ready to fly off in search of nectar and a mate. You can do your part to help the butterflies by planting milkweed in your yard. I hope that you enjoyed learning about the monarch butterfly cycle. Subscribe to Butterfly Realm and give us a follow on Instagram. Thank you for watching.